We continue learning workbook page 116 with the following problem. A spotlight is mounted on the eaves of a house 24 feet above the ground. A flower bed runs between the house and the sidewalk, so the closest a ladder can be placed to the house is 18 feet. How long a ladder is needed so that an electrician can reach the place where the light is mounted? Okay, so it, it helps to draw a picture for this problem. So we've got our house, we've got our light which is mounted on the eaves of the house, we've got our flower bed here, and we've got our sidewalk. Now, let's go ahead and label some of the dimensions that have been provided for us in the problem. It says that the light is mounted 24 feet above the ground. So this distance right here is 24 feet. And it says that the uh, flower bed, which is between the house and the sidewalk, is such that the closest a ladder can be placed to the house is 18 feet. So this distance right here is 18 feet. So you can see that that creates a triangle where the ladder will go. The ladder is going to be placed right here. And the question is, how long a ladder is needed so that an electrician can reach the light? Okay, let's isolate the triangle part of this particular diagram. So here's what we see. There's a 24 here, there's an 18 here, and this is an unknown length to us. Okay, so let's go ahead and solve this problem. According to the Pythagorean theorem, a squared plus b squared equals c squared. So we get 18 squared plus 24 squared equals c squared. 18 squared is 324, 24 squared is 576, and 324 plus 576 is 900. So we get 900 equals c squared, or if you prefer, c squared equals 900. Okay, we're going to solve this by factoring. We'll move the 900 to the left side. c squared minus 900 is equal to 0. This is a difference of squares, c minus 30 and c plus 30. By the zero product property, c minus 30 equals 0, or c plus 30 equals 0. So we get c equals 30, or c equals negative 30. But remember, c represents a distance, it's the length of the ladder, and a distance cannot be negative. So we throw away our extraneous solution, and we find that our final answer is c equals 30. So the ladder length needs to be 30 feet.